Hello, how are you today? I'm great. It's been a great day today. I've had grandchildren, children. It's been a great day. Had a good church service on television today. Enjoyed it very much. I feel like I'd enjoy some of my mom's cooking. Mm -hmm. We had veggies mm -hmm. and green beans and ribs yeah. and mac and cheese and uh -huh. potato salad. Mm -hmm. Did you get a cookie? Mm-hmm. <laughs> and some chocolate. And, yeah, some candy. <laughs> <laughs> you got a permanent in your hair, didn't you? <laughs> so, um, they wanted to know, let's see, someone asked if you had a picture of you and Grandpa when y'all were married. I, have, I forgot to tell you about that. Um, we'll have to look for that, but... I'll just have to look back. Yeah, we'll, we'll find that. All right, my mom says she'll help you find that. I forgot to tell you that. Okay. So maybe, won't you tell them how, tell them about your wedding. <laughs> oh, my wedding? Sure. Well. They'd love to hear stories, any uh, kind of story you want to tell them. Grandpa was in service, and he was supposed to get a 10-day leave. And we were going to get married and go on a honeymoon. Well. When he came home, found out that they had had an alert, and the only way they would let him come home was he had to promise them he would be back the next day. So we got married that afternoon, went away for the night. He brought me home the next morning and left to go back, and it was about a month before I saw him again. Wow. Which which part of service was this one? He was see. in the Army at that time. He finished out that tour in the Army. We went to Germany for a while and came back. And then he told me he was going to transfer over to the Air Force. And he did. And uh, so he spent... Uh, the war years he spent in the Navy. When the war was over, they would not let him re-enlist in the Navy because he was colorblind. <laughs> Wonder why he got colorblind. <laughs> <laughs> All them guns he was shooting on that ship. <laughs> and the name of the ship was the Rose, which is the passenger ship now. <laughs> but anyway, he went down and joined the Army. We went to Germany after we got married, was over there three years. Our daughter was about a year, a year old when we went, and she was, but she loved Germany. She loved being with her daddy, most of all, because she got to know her daddy. And then when we came back from Germany, they sent him back to Fort Bragg, North Carolina, which he never, he had been there one time before, and he hated Fort Bragg, the military at Fort Bragg. He didn't, he loved the town, but he did not like the base there. So he come home one night, and he told me he had put in for his discharge. He was going to come out of the Army and go into the Air Force which he did, and the rest of his 21 years was spent in the Air Force. And we loved the Air Force. It was good for us. So that probably uh, was good that Tyler joined the Air Force mm -hmm. then, huh? Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, when Tyler was a little boy, him and Grandpa would lay down there on that floor, and Grandpa would have all these pictures that he had made during his years in service, and Tyler would say, I'm going to be just like Grandpa. I'm going to be just like Grandpa. So I'm not surprised that he's in the Air Force. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Is there anything else you want to tell him? Just, uh, I hope you have a blessed day. And remember that whatever comes or goes, God loves you. There you go.
God loves you. Bye-bye. Y'all have a wonderful day.